Raptor, what? Guys, welcome to the National Hardware Show here in 2024 in Las Vegas, Nevada. We're way off the farm today, and today we're gonna take you around and show you some of the coolest stuff that we have here at the show. I've got Jason Couch right here, hey. and Jason, you are with? Dirt Box Overland. Dirt Box Overland. So the first thing we're gonna show you guys is this awesome Raptor Arb with the Dirt Box Overland setup in it. Let's have some fun. Woo! So Jason, take it away, man. I know you're an Overland guy, right? Mm -hmm. yep. And you're a truck guy, you're a work guy. What you got here? So we are here at the tool show because we kind of found that things cross over with the Overland world and the tool stuff. Plus I've always built equipment, work trucks and whatnot all our life. So hence we're here. Yeah. This is the dirt box topper. Yep. We're going to open this bad boy up. We've got dual compression latches on this thing. This all aluminum? It's all aluminum. Okay, gotcha. Construction all the way through this guy. What's okay. cool about this is we're working with Jackery on our power source for the for the tool stuff. Gotcha. What's beautiful about that is I don't have a big loud clattering gen uh, generator going to town. Yep. Making yep. noise, disturbing everybody. And it gives us power for everything we need. We can run gotcha. it off of recharging it with the truck itself on an inverter, or we can do a solar setup. Nice. The truck goes fast. So but up on the top, you've got some solar panels sitting up here, yeah, right? Yeah, baby. We okay. have got, so you've got, that's a mobile solar panel setup that can be plugged in, put wherever you want. Yep. Think about this, you guys. Now, this goes more over to the camping world. When you are camping, you're generally not sitting in the blazing sun. You want to be outside of the weather. Right. Or if you're working, you've got this somewhere else. We've got leads that'll go 20 feet for those solar panels, so I can set up a little array out here. Awesome. That's a nice little charge option. Very cool. And the beautiful thing too with, one of the reasons we like the Jackery setup is their charge times are incredibly fast. It used to be six, seven, eight, nine, ten 10 hours. Yeah. Now with Jackery, we're down around two hours to 2.5 hours from zero to hero like that. Nice, Let's see Next the other side. Take yeah. me around, show me the Bring other up. side, what we got so here. So we got this guy there, open up the back end here. And you guys cu fully custom build this topper. We build these toppers right. for everything. And you can jump up and down. A full grown man can get up on top of that thing. On the outside. On the outside. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so gotcha. You've gotcha. got L track right up through here. Yep. And then those crossbars mounted that L track. You look at the profile of this extrusion. Yep. And that is set up for lock bolts, uh, mounts. You can make, <clears throat> the cool thing is you can make whatever you want with that if it's a ladder rack, a pipe rack, or things that we'll be building for you later on can be mounted onto that extrusion. Nice. So I'm going to open up both sides. Yeah, go for it. Another Jackery, and this is just showing all the little goodies that you could stick on there. So and we have little hang on by. hanging on the molly panels. They yeah. literally could go in two different ways. It could come off and hook through there. Okay. Or you could actually break. There's a uh, relief cut in this. You could try to snap that guy off. It's not easy, but yeah. then it'll bolt in. You know, mount into those holes, whichever size. For you a want. more permanent installation. Yep. Exactly. Gotcha. And then all your stuff just goes on that. I mean. We've got our little so our little holsters that go in here, so you can hang your to tools from the molly panels as well. Nice. So and there's a fold out. There was a fold out thing oh, on here. Is yeah, that the hitchhiker? You got? That's, hitchhiker, that's the martini yeah. table. This is when you're doing your project. Okay, Sits on yep. there, rests through there, and nice. you've got whatever you need to do through there. So that you can put all your tools up here, pencils, yep. pens, whatever you want to do. You've exactly. got a workstation right here. If you need to do some intricate small work, you've got that covered that's right exactly there. Right when you get done face. with it, fold it up. Hang it back in here and you're good there to go. go. You got it. And then you could go through. One of the nice things is tool organization and storage. What we've done here, everyone's like, oh yeah, it's a, a toolbox, whatever. Yep. It is, but what most people don't have is we can also bring out just this deck system as well. Gotcha. So you do your lumber, you could, for the Overland world, we'll have a refrigerator on there. For the work world, material, tools, etc. Or, of course, you do your full drawer as well. Nice, so nice. So it gives you nice room. What's going to be happening on the these units right now that are coming in next, on the sides, left and right, is going to be an access panel on both sides. You can put an extra battery, air compressor, whatever you need, and have those permanently mounted in there, which is very great. cool. Very so that's nice. nice. You know, and you got all your goodies throughout that. Yeah, uh, yeah. A, a beautiful setup with this. What makes it different? It's like all right, whatever. It's aluminum topper. Whoopie doo da. Well, the whole perimeter of this. It's got extruded aluminum going through there with the same slotting that I keep talking about mounting bolts and hardware in. You've got them up through here, you've got it through there. Gotcha. You've got what makes this really special too is our mounting systems which vary for each vehicle. This one happens to tie into factory pull points in the Ford bed right there, which makes okay. it ultra bulletproof. Cool. And you're sh showing me here that this bolts in with the actual yes. bolts that I'm, hold the bed I'm in place. I'm glad you pointed that out. So 
there's a subframe that this whole thing goes into, mounts to the factory bed mounts. Gotcha. Then this goes in there. The nice thing that you could also do, if you don't want to do the twin drawer system, you can just do half of this guy. Sweet. It just gives you room for bigger stuff throughout that on there. The Another nice thing is you got illumination. We're powering this through the Jackery setup just because yeah. this battery on the Raptor is going to be dead by the end of the show. But the Jackery will keep us going. That kills those. This is also for power. I have an auxiliary socket up here. Okay, yeah. Um, all the goodies that you need through there. But nice. the key to the Dirt Box program is modularity. Yep. Being able to put this onto this vehicle, add things to it, carry it over from our camping world to our work world. And that's the other key thing that works well with the Jackery product modularity, meaning I could have two power packs here, yeah. one charging batteries while we're doing a job, I could carry the other one upstairs instead of asking the gal, can I borrow your outlet and blow it when you're cutting, drying your hair in the bathroom? Nice. Now I've got mobile power there as well. So you can get a blow dryer on that. That's good for the ladies. <laughs> That's right. Where can people find out more information about sure. the Dirtbox? It's dirtboxoverland.com. Dirt box see you guys there. Kevin, yeah. good to meet you. This good is to meet you too, Josh. Kevin with Jackery. Guys, we've worked with Jackery in the past. We're not working with Jackery right now, but I'm going to let Kevin tell you because they've got something very unique right here. Uh, for the Jackery battery backup bank system. So, Kevin, take it away. This is our Jackery Solar Generator 4000 Plus. It's made di directly for home backup. Uh, as you can see here, there is a modular expandable capacity, which doubles the capacity all the way up to uh, 10, 12,000 kilowatt hours. Oh, nice. Oh, sorry, 12,000 watt hours. So this so, is a, what's that? Yeah, this is our automatic transfer switch, and it plugs directly into our 2000 Plus through the 30 amp plug, and it allows you to cut back and forth the power between your house and the battery. So, for example, whenever your house runs out of power, yep. when this is hooked up to your home power system, your refrigerator will be backed up directly, your, all your appliances, your microwave, your lamps, your lighting, all your communication devices, at the push of a button, um, when the power cuts out, you will, you will have full home power backup. Nice, awesome. And that is from Jackery. As you can see, there's all kinds of cool interior, exterior stuff. There's everything here from pergolas and umbrellas to awesome tools like right over here we've got Cynics which is some battery power gear really really cool stuff autonomous lawnmowers grills all kinds of stuff if I don't show it to you in this video let me know what you want to see in the next video I've never been here to the show and it's really interesting not a ton of people here so we got room to explore and show you guys the coolest stuff guys we are with dr xi this is ryan xi from taiwan he has invented a hammer with the spring system in it okay so instead of a standard claw hammer e -oh, ah, e -oh, dig it dig it it's in i swear it's in my back pocket right here <laughs> <laughs> instead of a standard claw hammer he's invented a hammer with a spring in it and what this thing does is it reduces the work that you have to produce to sling the hammer. So when you sling the hammer, it goes, when you strike, you get the spring action going down, it pushes it further, and it springs it back up. So it reduces the load on your wrist as you drive the nail, which is really, really cool. So a harder strike than a standard claw hammer, and it also bounces back. So the rebound effect helps to reduce wear on your wrist as you drive this down into the block. Now we're going to get down on the ground and we'll show you guys real quick. We're going to hit it with the regular hammer if I can get it out of my pocket. I think it may be, oh there it is. So a standard hammer and this hammer. Awesome. Oh, you can find more research. This is a brand new product. This is at www.dentop.com.tw. I'll post the link down in the video description for you guys. Let me show you as I drive a nail. So the Dentop hammer and the standard hammer right here. We're going to knock this guy in. Okay, so just tap, tap, tap. No rebound effect, right? We're gonna hit this too. No rebound, right? So now, <laughs> I can't drive a nail. That's, is this the hardest wood that we've got? <laughs> when you strike this, you see the rebound. It bounces back up, okay? So it reduces the amount of load that you have to have on your hand. As you sling down, it bounces it back up, so it's going to slowly reduce by 30 to 40 percent the amount of work that it takes to drive a nail. We got, we got better nails? There we go. Let's try one more. If I bend this nail over, you guys can laugh. Bam! So the rebound effect pushes it back up. Pretty cool. And let me show you guys something. We have developed a crowd around us. <laughs> That's awesome. Check it out, guys. I'll post the link down in the video description. That is one of the coolest parts of the show right there. You're meeting the actual inventors of products. And I don't care if he's from Thailand, from China, or from America. It doesn't matter to me. That's cool that he's inventing things. That guy's a dentist. And he invented those hammers for dental work. And then he transferred it over into 
the construction world. That's really cool. This is the inventor of a three-wheeled cart that's foldable that goes up and down stairs and can run over debris and can run over grass, it can run over gravel, it can run over sticks, anything, and easily be stored in a tiny space, a tiny apartment space. So really, really cool. You can put it in a closet because you don't need a cart sitting around. You need That takes up garage space, shop space, and, and we're living in smaller and smaller homes. So uh, very cool invention. Uh, where can someone find this? Internet, our website, appcart.com. Appcart.com. Such a language barrier. There's so many people from all over the world here. It's a huge language barrier. I couldn't understand them, but I'll post a link down in the video description. Super handy. All right, guys, we are with Aaron. Aaron, thank you so much for showing us what you have here. You, Aaron is with OmniWall. OmniWall is a awesome, you can see it. They're, they're all hanging right here. We're gonna let Aaron kind of take you around and show you guys what OmniWall, but first, we need to know, this is an all steel, American-made, pegboard type system. We got stuff for your power drill kits, all your battery charges. We do have, you know, outlet or uh, power strips that are designed to go behind the panel and plug in behind the wall. So you don't have to worry about that. We got your hand tools, got your air tools. Yep. Uh, we got a new product line, the rack coming out. That's also going to be a workbench. It's Can you get these in any color? Yep. We Virtually, got is this your color, Matt? No, we have <laughs> yeah, no. We have six colors. They're all shown right here okay, on this panel. Nice. These are our six flagships. Awesome. Got all your major tool brands Very and then nice. some. We just passed something though. We passed a cabinet. We got mop closet right yep. here. What we got here? What's this cabinet? Oh yeah. We got Check a cabinetry line. So mop closet cabinet. We have full locking bar lock cabinet. Awesome. Um, it hangs directly on our panels, so you can just move them in or out. Cool. Very yep. nice. Very nice. So in the back side and on the walls, you have the Omni wall product right here that can hang anything on. Take yep. me around. Let's Absolutely. see what else we got. Yeah, so we got the pantry wall, some more cabinetry. We got a shoe rack slash clothes rack. Nice. So you can hang off the walls. So you can use baskets. this not only in the shop, in the kitchen, anywhere. In the, in so the mud room. Yeah, it's perfect. Bam. We got yeah. the pantry going. Look at that. All sorts of shelving options we have for you. The hooks. We got the paper towel holders. All of our oh, yeah. stuff is metal, so you can use magnetic accessories with them and just kind of Sweet. move it around, make it your own. Very cool. Which is now, huge. even over here, we've got something for the uh, outdoor enthusiast right over yeah, here, some too. Sporting don't goods. Look just at that. a couple sporting, sporting goods, goods store? items. Yeah. Very so cool. we got in the firearms. We also offer uh, UV ink cured printing uh, up to four foot by eight foot, so you can personalize it. We sell this oh. American flag kit as a nice. standard item on our website. That's really uh, cool. But yeah, we got all sorts of stuff for the pew pews. Yep, and you've got, um, here's another one that's very interesting. I see this magnetic mat so you can pick up the yep. screws and stuff. Yeah, I just call this kind of like the junk drawer, but it's on the wall. It's yeah. just like you want your quick that's access so stuff. Cool, it, isn't it? It's a hodgepodge of items. Awesome. You got stuff for your belt, your tape measures. Uh, again, more lights, shelving. And then almost like pallet racking here, pretty yep. much, pretty close to pallet it's racking. A six foot version of the rack we saw over there. Again, nice. it has the pegboard or omni wall on the sides. So you can hang stuff inside and out. Now you like were saying something. You can't. You can scratch this, but it won't rust. It is not galvanized. It is. It is galvanized. Galvanized. So zinc what impregnated is, material so to start with. Yeah. So that's uh, basically a zinc impregnated type material that'll keep yep. it from rusting, even if you scratch it or drag even if something you across it. it. Something else really cool. I don't know how many of you guys have thought about a greenhouse like this in your backyard, but I know I have. This is Ilya, from. Climb up on greenhouses. Okay, so we're gonna walk through this while he talks us through and tells us all about this absolutely awesome modular greenhouse system right here. And you've already worked with some municipalities, with schools, with, uh, you said SpaceX has a couple of these? Yes. Really we have cool. Purchased a couple of units for their star base in Texas. Nice, awesome. Well, I'm gonna let him take it from here. Thanks, Josh. So here we got the uh, uh, Deshagon model. It's a fairly new design that we've recently developed with our partners. And uh, what you're looking at, it's all aluminum framing, uh, which does not rust. It's coated in premium paint, comes in different colors as well. Yep. And it also is all stainless steel hardware, which means it's not going to rust. It's not going to corrode after multiple years of use. And the best part of it, if something ever was to break, you had a tree fall on it, yeah. all parts can be replaced. Uh, it does come with several different options for the glazing materials that you can use. Over here, you can see a solid polycarbonate. Yeah. And here on the roof, we got 10 millimeter uh, multi-wall polycarbonate. So what if it gets too hot in here? 
Well, if it gets too hot in here, you've got some roof, oh, sorry, wool vents. Yep. Which uh, over here are, are displayed with manual openers, but we do offer automatic heat powered openers, which would automatically expand the moment temperature goes above 75 degrees. That's you awesome. You can also adjust them. Um, as far as the materials, all the polycarbonate sheeting has UV coating, which means it's not going to discolor or turn yellow after years and years of use. Okay. And if you've had one for over 10, 15 years and something started to look a bit shady, then you can always Ordering. switch up the parts, yep. replace them and make it look brand new. Nice. So a lifetime frame and a uh, replaceable parts if you need to. And yes. you have some modular system set up things with different accessories you can put in here too. You uh, that shows some of the accessories that we offer. Okay, uh, it's very two cool. two-tier shelving that you can just at preferred height. Uh, it's wall louvers that would provide additional airflow inside your greenhouse. Okay. And also solar-powered fans that you can uh, that are regulated with the thermostat, and you can adjust them at the temperature you want your greenhouse to get additional ventilation. Tell me what we have here also. So you've got some smaller units here for like patios for folks that live in apartments, is that right? Absolutely. We offer a line of products that can fit any gardener's need, no matter whether you have space or not. Um, seems like it's becoming more and more popular to grow your own food, grow your own uh, plants and flowers. So some units like that would allow that if you do not have the space. Awesome. Well, thanks, man. Appreciate it. Tell me, where, we, where can people find these? We're out of Issaquah in Washington State, so would be happy to have you check us out. Our website is climapod.com. That's Reach it. Reach out. We'll be there for you. Thanks, buddy. Told you we're going to show you some really cool stuff. This is the Rhino Cart. Rhino Cart, and I've got the Rhino Cart expert here. Eddie, Eddie, I'm going to hand this to you and let All you right. take it away, brother. All right, buddy. We've got the Rhino Cart. What it is is an all-terrain moving cart. It expands out and in. It goes to 46 inches and goes down, as you see, just about to nothing. So what we're going to do is we're going to move a gun safe, and I'll show you all how it works. You're going to come over and you're going to size it up to whatever you're moving. You're going to drop it on the floor. You're going to tilt what you're moving, slide it under it. Kind of pull it back towards you, and you're ready to go. And this will hold up to 2,000 pounds, 2, is that right? 2,000 pounds, yes, it gotcha. will, Josh. Gotcha, So the reason I stopped over here at this booth is because a good buddy of mine dropped a gun safe on his ankle recently. Oh, man. Really, really horrible situation. If he had had that, no. would have nixed yeah. that problem You don't have totally. to worry about it, yeah. What you'll so, do is you'll, if you've got a rough obstacle you're trying to get up, you're just going to try to get back here and you're going to just kind of go over whatever you need to go over. Nice. Awesome. You said this is all terrain. It'll roll on dirt, grass, gravel. It, it will go over anything packed. Yes. Gotcha. So I'm bringing the bringing the safe into the house. Now what? I got to turn the safe around. Oh, okay. So we just turn it around. That's pretty turn awesome. Turn it around any way you want to turn it. Nice, nice. Right back down. Easy to handle. He said this is about yep. 800 pounds. I can turn it. Oh, you can turn like it on this, that even on an incline. Wow. So. That's awesome. Not a problem. It's really top heavy. You might not want to do that. That is awesome. Cool. So you're just ready to go. Nice. Zero degree turn. Cool. Yeah, we can knock signs oh, off. Oh, you things. can knock signs off? Yeah. You can right even, on. even. Tilt it that way. Tilt huh? it sideways. Nice. So Eddie, if you need to get over something. How does somebody find this? You can find them on Costco.com. Home Depot, our website, rhinocart.com. Okay. Amazon, uh, Lowe's, Home Depot.com. Awesome. Anywhere, everywhere. Anywhere, everywhere. Most, no doubt. So it's raining rhino carts everywhere, guys. Let's go check out something else. I guess that's it for today. Uh, so, Eddie, you're going to be my Josh. last guy. Appreciate man. you, buddy. Thank you so much. Awesome product, guys. Thank you so much for joining me here at the National Hardware Show in Las Vegas, Nevada. We got a lot of fun to have tonight, and we'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. We're going to the outdoor stuff. Awesome. Come on down to the Stony Ridge, bring your wife and bring your kids, we're living life pure and sweet, that's the way it's supposed to be, Stony Ridge. Now we get there, <laughs> so we're together, all right? All right. <laughs> Standard claw hammer. E -o -i -e -o. Dig it, dig it. Get right here. <laughs> Look who's holding my camera. You know that guy? Dirt bucket! <laughs> you know how hard it was to stay quiet? <laughs> we got more, we got more, we got influencers everywhere!